Revelation chapter 13. Verse 16, and it reads, And he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a M-A-R-K in the right hand or in the forehead, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the M-A-R-K, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. First and foremost, only give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Next, double honors to the head apostles slash elder bishops of Great Millstone, the one that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible. Peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere Akims. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith, regardless of people here for about why these ninjas are walking around trying to get rich, trying to get a name for themselves, trying to get notoriety. You know what I'm saying? You know. The scriptures tell us marvel not at the works of sinners. You see? So when we're not jealous of nobody. This, this is what we're talking about. We're bringing out the prophecies. All right? The man of the Lord is supposed to prophesy. It's supposed to tell you what's going to happen before it even happened. You see? Not brag about their um, lavish lifestyle or how much money they got, how much cars they got, where they been, where they where they going, and all that. We don't give a damn about that, man. We're here to prophesy. We're we, we warning our people of what's going to happen before it even happened. Look, look, look. The, 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 the see here. You know what I'm saying? Implants that let you pay with your hands. Scan and go. Scan and go. That's what it's about, man. All right? This, 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 this is what we wanted our people about. You're not going to be able to buy and sell without an implantable device in the near future. In the near little nearer than what we believe. But we, so, so, so let these other false groups, you know what I'm saying, brag about what they got. You know what I'm saying? But, but they'll never tell you what they had to do to get it. They 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 uh, made this ministry of ours. I'm saying a marketing a marketing business for selling shirts and hats and do rags and <clears throat> you know fringes and all this madness. And one thing about um, Great Millstone, we don't just let anybody just because you know you're a Hebrew is like that don't mean you're gonna join us. You see, well, you, you find out you're a Hebrew is like saying you know uh, you join us the, the next day and all that. No man. You see what well, well, quality. Over quantity. It's always quality over quantity. Marvel not at the works of sinners. Listen, this this is what's going down. This devil's is going to make it mandatory that you take a, an, an implantable device <clears throat> in order to buy and sell, in order to get from one location to the next. This is what we need to be talking about, right? And then these Israelites, they go off, you know what I'm saying, on the doctrine or whatever. We get on them, you know what I'm saying? Look, look, the scriptures tell us to reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. Because a time will come where they will not endure sound doctrine, but they will heap to themselves teachers having itch. It is anything that sounds good. Anything that sounds good, right? And 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 refrain. The scriptures tell us to refrain from all appearance of evil. So so let these false prophets have it, man. Y'all can y'all got it, man. Y'all got it. The Lord told us, don't exhort ourselves. Because look, he will bring us low. See, see, a great common is coming. See, see starvation, pro prophecy, like the Lord have us say all the time, prophecy is going to fix everything. When that stomach starts starving, and you got all the, and then going, going right back to the 1930s, hey, they had, there was people that had billions of dollars and millions of dollars, but when it ain't nothing, no food to buy with all that money, then what? When it ain't no ice to buy, I remember a couple of years back, you know what I'm saying, um, a, a tornado came through the Carolinas, knocked out all the power, and it didn't matter how much money you got. If it won't no ice at the store, you ain't, you ain't getting no ice. You see, if it won't no water at the store, you can have thousands of dollars, but if it won't no water at that store, riches profit not in a day of wrath, but righteousness delivered from death. You, you forgot about that too, though, right? But look, what did it say again? The sea hip implants that let you pay with your hands. It's you and all this madness, man. Oh, they're, oh, they're false ass prophets, man. You see? Oh, false ass prophets, man. But it's all good, though. Um, Patrick. Puny causes causes a stir whenever you pay for something in a shop or a restaurant. This is because a 37-year-old doesn't need to use a bank card or his mobile phone to pay. Instead, he simply places his left hand near the ca contactless card reader and the payment goes through. What? Me tell me he bought some. Me tell me he went to the store. He bought some without cash. You say it ain't so. Say it ain't so. Say it ain't so, man. 
The reaction I get from cash is and are priceless, says Mr. Pumi, a security guard from the Netherlands. He is able to pay using his hand because back in 2019, through I call it through 2019, he had a contactless payment CHIP injected under his skin. The procedure hurts as much as when someone pinches your skin. You mean tell me he didn't have to go through a long, drawn-out surgery laying on the table ah, and all that? No, man. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, right? He said, he said, you can pinch yourself. He said, it hurts about that much, man. It's going down. I'm reading the scripture right now. That ain't going right. That ain't it, you know what I'm saying? But they got something smaller. I mean, for process time, that ain't go right there. There we go. There we go. What it say again? Revelation 13, 16. This is what we're talking about. So we're here to prophesy. We're here to tell you what's going to happen before it even happened, right? Revelation 13, 16. And he calls up all. Who is the he? The elite banking families, the Rothschilds, the Gettys, the Bloombergs, the Offenheimers, the Shirkin Groovers, right? The people that's actually ruling the earth. Remember, Job 9, 24, the earth was given into the hands of the wicked, right? It says he calls of all, both small and great. It doesn't matter who you are. Rich or poor, you could be a bum on the street, you know what I'm saying? You could be rich as all know what, free and bond, walking around the street, locked up to receive a MRK. You see that digital device, that implantable device, right? To receive a MARK, a karagma, an incision, something being actually inserted inside of you, right? And, and, and then look, storms every damn well, you know what I'm saying? You see, Ireland, Spain, and Norman, um, shit, man, it's just going down. Storms everywhere, floods everywhere, wars everywhere, uproars of the people everywhere, protests everywhere. But these ninjas bragging about how much money they got, and, and, and somebody's jealous of them. Are, are you see, are you, you ninjas don't know what time it is. Are you ninjas not see, a prudent man for see if the evil and hide it from himself, but the simple pass on and destroy. You ninjas are third graders, man. You ninjas, you Israelite ninjas out there, y'all act like damn third graders, man. You see? You don't act like adults. You don't act like men and women. Even the damn women silly as hell, which we already know that anyway. But the majority of you Israelite men, the heads of these groups, y'all act like little damn kids, man. You see? That's what a kid does, man. Brags about what he got, you know what I'm saying, and makes fun of the people who don't got what he got. What we do that at? You see? Simple as shit, man. What did it say? To receive an M-A-R-K in the right hand or in their forehead, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the M-A-R-K, the karagma, that implantable device. Just like this, that's like you see in this picture right here. You're not going to be able to buy or sell, soon come. You see? Damn. And all kind of people didn't got it already. It's all kind of people walking around. You got a C-Hip girl, you know what I'm saying? Walk around at the grocery store. You had that woman, um... So like you, you had that woman, look, look uh, she got it. You had that other woman, you know what I'm saying, that was at the grocery store with her husband. She got it. She, look, her husband didn't know that she got it, you know what I'm saying, but she got it. She went she went right up to the counter, swiped her hand, paid for the stuff, and she said her offspring was going to get it too. I'm just going through the article a little bit. Look at him. That's that, that's that dude right there. They got to see him, right? What it say in 17 is that no man might buy or sell. You're not going to be able to purchase, and the people that's actually ruling, uh, running their businesses, you're not going to be have your business. On, you're not your business is not going to be able to function without that digital technology. And when you're letting you, we letting you know according to the Bible what's going to happen before it even happens. The hell with the shaking and jiving. I, I'm rich. I'm rich. I'm rich. Nobody gives a damn about your riches, man. You're not rich towards the Lord, though. You see, you're spiritual bums. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're rich carnally, but you're spiritual. Bums, you know what I'm saying? And it ain't gonna profit you in the day of the wrath of the Lord. Just know that, man. Just know that. Because once again, you can have all the money in the world, but it ain't if it ain't no food, then what? I once again, I remember when a major storm came down here. There was a whole lot of people standing in line, you know what I'm saying, trying to get uh ice and thin food and things of that nature, but it won't nothing. It won't none. So it don't it don't matter how much money you got, man. Remember though, the Lord said, My servants shall eat though, right? And you can read on into the, into the it's many articles that I can bring up. But for the process of time, I, I, I'm gonna bring out a couple of scriptures, then I'm, then I'm gonna roll. This is just a quick update of what's going on. Why these ninjas on the street corners looking stupid as hell, you know what I'm saying? Uh, bragging about what they got, you know what I'm saying? Making videos spinning around in Hellcats. They, what is they gonna do for our people, man? Our people need answers, man. Our people need this word. No gimmicks, man.
Would it say, and that no man might, 17, Revelation 13, 17, and that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the M-A-R-K, the Karagma, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. So, so come, you're not going to be able to buy or sell without this implantable device. And I'm going to leave it up on the screen for a minute. As many articles, you know, something that I can bring up. I want to bring up a couple of scriptures, then I'm going to wrap it up, because I got to get ready to roll. This is Isaiah. The Lord said, go out there and give them warning for me, and that's exactly what we do. The hell with all that play. We ain't jealous of none of you ninjas. You see? Uh, Isaiah 42 and 9. Because uh, uh, your following ain't nothing but um, a bunch of um, non-desirables. You see, that's all it is. The people that's following you other false Israelite groups, they're non-desirables. You see? Isaiah 42. Look, look, we preach this word for the whole for elect of the nation of Israel, which consists of the so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, and Israelites has been scattered throughout the four corners of the earth that may look like these heathens. You see? Let's get this, Isaiah 42 and 9. Behold, the former things have come to pass, and new things do I declare, and new things do we declare, and new things do we declare that are the uh, see here. You see, that implantable device. We got to be careful um, when we say certain things because they'll take our video down. And new things do I declare before they spring forth, I tell you of them. So before this, this devil makes it mandatory for you to take an implantable device, the Lord have his prophets tell you of it. Should the Lord power would do nothing, but he revealed his secrets and to his servants, the prophet. You, you forgot about it. Don't you supposed to be revealing the secrets of the Lord? But now you're revealing, I'm saying, jet setting and all this, all this nonsense, man. They ain't doing our people no good. Oh, yeah, you're a bum. You're a bum. You're a bum. Well, you got all this damn money. You got $150 million. You ain't having no damn body out. You see? We doing more for our people than these ninjas doing. We're starting off with elder apostles to hard, you know what I'm saying? You see, the elder bishops, you know what I'm saying? A great millstone, the men on down there, Phyllis. We're doing more for our people than these false prophets. These false prophets, they ain't doing nothing, you know what I'm saying? But um, pretty much trying to um, make themselves look like some type of people. They, ain't, they really ain't helping them out. We're helping our people out. Where's the love? Where's the love? The Lord said, if you love me, feed my sheep with the knowledge, wisdom, understanding of the scriptures. Now, the, the, the vain as shit. The average Israelite group, they're vain as shit, man. Everything they do, they got to record. They go here, they got to record. They go there, they got to record. They buy this, they got to record it. This is just, just nonsense, man. You see? But 2 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 11. Least Satan, the word Satan means adversary, should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices, his schemes, his plots, his tricks, his gadgets, his mechanical devices. You know what I'm saying? His mechanisms. You go into the definition for the word device. That's exactly what pops up. So we're not ignorant of what our enemy, our adversary, is up to. But you ninjas is. You're a little prudent. I want to get that too. I quoted it earlier. Let's just get it right quick. We better walk. We better act like we got uh, us hopeful Lex. We look, stay focused. Us hopeful Lex, stay focused, man. You see? Let them ninjas have it, man. Once again, marvel not at the works of sinners, man. You see? And, 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 um, Sirach, I think it's 16 and 10. It says, um, marvel if, if these wicked ninjas go unpunished. Just marvel at it, man. Taking back room di deals, 501, C3 Charles. They didn't did away with the name of the Lord. Come on, man. Proverbs 22 and 3. And it reads, a prudent man for see if they even hide it from himself. We see exactly what's coming down the pipeline. So we hiding ourselves within the comfort of AKA this word, right? It says, but the simple pass on and are punished. So it's going to be a whole lot of Israelites starving their asses off soon come. They're going to be standing in that sea hip line, you know what I'm saying? And, and the scriptures tell us, never trust thy enemy anyway. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. You see? So, so we're, we're rich towards the Lord, right? Plus, we don't give a damn about this status. We don't care about no status. We don't care about trying to be famous and rich, trying to get a... We don't want no name for ourselves, you see? We just humble service. A great humbling is coming, right? When your back, when your stomach is touching your back, let's see if you're going to brag in that day. There ain't going to be no bragging in that day. When that stomach touching that back, and a whole lot of Israelite groups are going to push this nonsense too. You see? They're going to push it, man. Uh, let's, let's see what else. I, I, I want to get this right quick because I'm about, I'm about to wrap it up. I just want to bring out that article and show you what time it is. Ezekiel chapter 3. Ezekiel chapter 3, verse 17. Let's go. Ezekiel chapter 3, verse 17. 
Remember, if you love me, feed my sheep, right? Ezekiel chapter 3, verse 17. And read, Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel, a people before some place. Therefore, hear the word of my mouth and give them warning from me. We warning you about this implantable device, right? Let's see if I can get another article right quick before I roll out. <clears throat> Human C hip implants take center stage. You, you ain't know about that either, did you? You ain't know about that. All these articles on that C hip, but it's June, it's June, it's June. Look at this, man. Human C hip implants take center stage, right? And you can play that video. I'm not even going to play that video. Um, home key with a C hip implant is gaining worldwide interest. But there's another more compelling story under the surface. Why is this technology in integrated circuit and size of a grain of rice by revile by some and celebrated by self-proclaimed humans? You see, whole lot of whole lot of people get it, and you can read into it. And everything's going digital. You go to the store. You see everything. Look, look. See hips in humans. Consumer friendly app or new frontier in surveillance. Both. Both. See hips. Where next? Uh, where where next for see hip implants? Just over and over, over and over, man. <clears throat> look at that. Company beats. Um, big on tiny um, C hips, you know what I'm saying? Implants. Let's see. I, I, I want to see something else. Let's see. C hip and skin. Implantable C hip gives payments its matrix uh, moment. Let's see. Swedish office building test um, C hip. And workers. It's over and over, over and over, man. You see it. Wisconsin companies use use of C hips implants raises questions. You see, you see it happening though, right? You see it happening. The C hip girl, there she go. C hip girl. Woman C hip implants in her hand goes viral. You see? All in the grocery store with it. You see? But oh yeah, we don't know what we're talking about though, right? Let's see what else before I roll out. Hitachi shows our world's smallest uh, C hip. You see, just over and over and over. Watch these workers get C hip at their company's um, C hip party. Just over. It was in 2017, but it's still relevant. It's still relevant. When, when you got all these false Israelite groups talking, so it's June. Ain't no C hip. Well, I'm seeing C hip parties and so forth. So look at this. Just over and over and over and over. You see? Just over and over and over and over, man. See hip breakthrough, um, poised to transform healthcare. You see that January thirty first, two thousand twenty four. That's new, man. All right, it's new. It's over and over. You see all these different articles, man. I will click on this one right quick. Got at least a minute left. Son of man, Ezekiel three and seventeen. Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore, hear the word of my mouth and give them one from me. So it is what it is, man. Let's see. Uh, RF. DC here breakthroughs poised to transform healthcare. Yeah, they're making people walk. No, they're making people see. You see, Make, making people hear, making people talk. And you can, you can read on to this because you know I'm saying uh, for process of time, you can read on. You see, it's over and over held to a higher standard. You see, you see that changes to me, modern demands. Everything's going modern now, Every, meaning everything's going digital. So in order for you to get on that damn plane soon, come you're going to need that C-hip. In order for you to go into that restaurant, you're going to need a C-hip. All right? In order for you to buy and sell, you're going to need a C-hip. But oh yeah, it's June and all the other nonsense, right? Come on, man. We're not ignorant of Satan devices. Let's go here. You see the images. You see it. You see it, man. It's going down soon, come. Your Israelites have been warned. You see it, man. And you ain't got to go through no long, drawn-out surgery. You see the woman right there, the dude right there, paying for his stuff? 
You see it being inserted right there with the black gloves? Come on, man. You see it right there, the size of a grain of rice? And you see that woman right there scan and go. Come on, man. We're not ignorant of Satan devices. You have been warned. Shalom.